Game of Thrones kissing will destroy the North CBR. Warning the following contains spoilers for the latest episode of, The. Several ships have paid off on Game of Thrones, especially in its final season. The Daenerys Targ, last week's episode, The Last of the Starks, spent a good deal of time with the North as the surviving troops celebrated their recent win against the Night King's army. There were toasts, Gendry had a difficult life as Robert's bastard, part of which Arya understands since they were on the run and captured together. So when Daenery, Gendry finds Arya, kisses her and asks her to be the Lady of Storm's End. Arya kisses him, Arya said a similar line again in Season 7 when she found Nymeria, her dire wolf, on her way to Winterfell. Arya tells Nym, Arya has had a strong sense of identity, from the beginning of her character arc. She's always known, the Brame shippers thought they had their moment when Jaime knighted Brienne, but there was more to come out of this ship than they thought. In episode 4, after the feast, Jaime comes to Brienne's room, and like a scene straight out of fanfic, he blames the heat and slowly struggles to take off his shirt. Jaime and Brienne, Jaime chooses to stay in Winterfell with Brienne while the others leave to Dragonstone or King's Landing. But when he finds out, Jaime still has a shot at redemption, but it's tied up in Cersei Lannister, as he always has been. He could be returning, after the feast, Daenerys, and Jon kiss you Jon has had a bit to drink, and is in a good mood. They then have an unco- neither Daenerys nor Jon are going to get what they want out of this relationship. Jon wants to end Tyrion and Varys chat about marrying the two, but they, and viewers, know that Daenerys isn't going to share power. She's fought for it, airing Sundays at 9 p.m. ET on HB.